Okay, guys. So today I did something impulsive. I went to the Apple store and got an iPad. <laughs> So today we're gonna do an unboxing and setup video for my iPad and the Apple Pencil. So I don't know why, but the past few days I felt like I needed an iPad. Um, not really sure why. What I'm doing for work right now doesn't really require an iPad except for obviously this. And I'm only in school for one more year, so it kind of doesn't make sense that I got an iPad, but I feel like because I'm only a student for one more year, I only get the student discount for one more year. So that was kind of my justification for this purchase. <laughs> okay, so I got the iPad Air and also the second generation Apple pencil i've been watching a lot of videos on these things so that's kind of the only reason i know what's going on right now this is the fifth generation 64 gigabyte wi-fi only i just don't feel like i needed the larger size because i can use an external hard drive and also i didn't think i needed to connect it to cellular service if that makes sense um and then the apple pencil So right now is July 26th. Today is when I bought it. And Florida, we are doing the tax-free holiday week for back to school. So that was another reason why I wanted to buy it now because obviously I got it with no taxes. Plus they are having a student deal right now where you get $100 off the iPad or you can get money off of a MacBook. I already have a MacBook, so I wanted the iPad. So the deal is you get $100 off the iPad plus a $100 gift card. So that's what I used towards the Apple Pencil. I ordered a bunch of accessories. I'm waiting for them to come in. The case is supposed to come in today. One of the main reasons I got the iPad is for taking notes for class. I feel like it'll just make things a lot easier, but also just to kind of plan and organize my life. I don't know if you've seen that TikTok where he's like, I'll put it in. You know why I feel like I'm stuck in life? It's because I ain't got an iPad. Like, no, I cracked the code. That's the reason. I don't know what's the science behind it, but I feel like if I get an iPad, my life would be better. And that is what I feel like, because I feel like I could plan out my life. And also, it's another tool for me to use to edit pictures and do all the things that I do for YouTube, school, work, etc. And also, I like how you can use it as a second monitor for your MacBook. I find that really helpful in my classes and I'm sure I will in the work world as well. I forgot if I mentioned this is the starlight color which is like the gold beige white color. Also a disclaimer I'm not a tech channel whatsoever. I do have a couple of other old videos unboxing other devices that I've purchased in the past and other techie videos like that. If you want to see more iPad content or more videos of me setting up my iPad or like what's on my iPad, how I use it for school, for editing and stuff like that, let me know and I'll make videos like that. I'm gonna switch the camera view so that you can see it a little better. Okay, so here's the box. Okay, so here's the iPad. Okay, so in the box you already obviously already know, but you get the little book, you get your you know instruction manuals, and obviously the stickers. I see everybody talking about these stickers. I've literally never used them or put them on anything, so and then of course you get the cube, which you don't get in the new iPhones anymore, so this is really nice. I did order a, a different cube that has two lightning ports so that you can charge like your MacBook and your iPad at the same time. And then obviously the USB-C cord. Okay, I'm gonna also unbox the pencil just while we're here. Mm. 
Okay, so same thing. Just get the little info and then the pencil. I usually don't like taking these wrappings off until like weeks later, so I'm gonna leave that on for now. But let's go back and look at the iPad. Almost forgot to take the wrapping off the iPad itself, so here we go. This is what it looks like. This is the color. It's just like a little pale silverish gold. I really like it. It's super neutral. Let's set this up. It's turning on. I'm trying to keep the paper on the back so that I don't scratch it or anything. So let's set it up. I'm going to set it up manually. I know a lot of people like sync it with their phones or like their other devices but i want this to be fresh and i want to start new because both of my other devices are so cluttered and unorganized like i don't know how to explain it like my phone has 150,000 pictures on it and i just can't go through them and delete the ones that i don't need and my computer has so many files just like scattered around from school and i just haven't had a chance to delete them or organize them so i want this to be fresh yeah, so I'm going to do set up manually and then choose my Wi-Fi. I don't know my password. <laughs> I don't know my Wi-Fi password by heart. Okay, so now we're setting up the Touch ID. This does have Touch ID on the top um, power button. I was asking me if I want to transfer apps and data onto this iPad. Like I said, I want to start new. So I'm going to say don't transfer and then I'm going to sign in with my Apple ID. So now I'm just going through all the prompts. <laughs> I can already see my fingerprints on it and it's really killing me. I'm gonna put it on light. Okay, welcome to iPad. <gasps> oh my god, here it is. This was such an impulse buy. I don't know how to use this. Like so many videos nowadays and like pages and TikToks dedicated to the iPad and like all these different apps you can use and all these different features it has. I just like I'm so not whatever okay so let's set up the pencil i guess we can take the wrapping off the pencil i'm gonna assume it's settings bluetooth i don't know <laughs> oh i probably have to <laughs> attach it yes Yay, there we go. Okay, let's write a few words. The Apple Pencil will basically just... My handwriting is so bad on it. It's basically just going to turn it, like, the words that you write into text. So that's my name. You can also remove text by scribbling it out. Um... And then you can also draw a line and then select text. Okay, so it took me a while, but I had to disable my iCloud so that all my 100,000 pictures on my phone would not go onto this. So let's download a couple of apps. Good Notes and Notability. I used to use Notability in, in middle school when I had an iPad for school and it was actually really good app. Oh, I wanted Canva. For me, that's very important for my major, but also for stuff like this. I make, I can make like thumbnails or for my like, like to know it or storefronts, I can make um, like the cover photos. So downloading in Canva. Also Lightroom is one of my most used apps on my phone and I want to be able to edit pictures on here. So definitely Gmail. Oh my god. I mean, 
there's so many more apps that I have to get, so we can go into that later. Yeah, but this is later me. My package came in for my case and the other accessory I was talking about. I wanted to show you. This is the case I got. It is the ESR protective tablet case. I'll have it linked below and in my Amazon storefront, like I said. But basically, what I like about it is that you can use it so many different ways. I got it in this light blue color. Also, it has this little flap that goes over the Apple Pencil so that if you put your iPad in your bag or somewhere, the Apple Pencil doesn't fall off. The magnets. So it has protection around all of the edges and you can take this whole part out if you just wanna use the iPad on its own without the stand. You can use the stand like that or like this or literally you can use it every single way you would ever need to use your iPad. I just don't know why but I literally think that this is gonna be the perfect case. And then one more thing, I got this Anchor Charger Nano Pro. Again, I'll have it linked below, but basically this is gonna be perfect for me because I have a phone, a MacBook, an Apple Watch, now this iPad, AirPods, literally everything. So when I'm traveling and even at home, it's just gonna make it a lot easier for me not to have to bring a million different cubes. So I got this one and it's 40 watts, so I feel like it'll be really fast. And it has two USB-C ports in it so that you can charge your MacBook and your iPad at the same time, your phone and your iPad, phone and MacBook, MacBook, you know, all the different variations. And it's light blue. They had a, ma a light blue that matches the case. So very excited. Those are the accessories. I guess let's just give it like a cute little background. Let me get Pinterest actually. <laughs> Pinterest linked down below if you want it. I don't really use it that much, but this is cute. I found one. It matches the aesthetic of the, it's like a neutral like marbling. It's coming up like white, but it's definitely like a beige and that matches the back. I'll play around with it. I'll get my iPad to be cute and a reflection of myself. Okay, so this is me coming back later. I was able to personalize it a little bit, so I just wanted to show you guys. Um, I'm not done, but um, so this is my background. All of these are from Pinterest. This is my home screen. So this is my regular home screen. Just has some widgets, Spotify, and most importantly, and then on this page, I haven't organized the apps, but I was able to put little widgets of my Pinterest boards so that my Pinterest um, pictures can like rotate throughout the day because my Pinterest board is so cute. Just literally my aesthetic. So I wanted that to be reflected on my iPad screen. So more details will be in another video if you want to see them, but I just wanted to show you guys my background so that you wouldn't be left hanging. Hey, I'm super excited. I feel so techy and like a pro college student. That is going to be it for today's unboxing and setup video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and if you want to see more iPad content, let me know and I will definitely learn and figure out a way to become one of those it girls for the iPad. So if you want anything that I mentioned in this video, it'll be linked below in my Amazon storefront. If you like my outfit, my necklace or anything, that is also linked in my storefront or on my like to know it. And all of my other social media links will be linked below. But thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you want to see more. Yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye. Mm -hmm.